Hi, my name is Luke's Boy. I am an enthusiast writer. I have been writing for the last 9-10 years to be specific. Uh, my bay is called Isabella and that's why you are watching Isabella Explodes. Now, over the many years, I have been seeing a lot of things on the road and I just decided, let me share my experiences because if I tell you, you won't believe it. For example, today along the Southern Bypass, which is in Nairobi, Kenya, I saw a hyena. Okay, it was dead and it was on the road. I think it was hit by pedestrians, but yep, I saw that today. And so I'm going to be sharing a lot of experiences, things that you will not believe and others which are funny. I'm going to be sharing my experiences. And right now I want to give a shout out to Frank Ndambuki and Kogi who are about to start riding. And so I'm going to be sharing my experiences on the road, things that will help you avoid accidents. I will share experiences that will help you learn how to navigate on the Kenyan roads and pretty much um, rules and regulations that will have helped me to avoid over 100 accidents which I believe will also help you. So I'm going to also to invite some veterans to be able to come and share their experiences so you're in for a ride with me literally. So today before we start I normally like having a word of encouragement. Today's words of encouragement are how can two work together unless they agree? Yep. And in light on that, now to the experience that I saw today. So there's these lorries that normally have messages on their bumpers. You know those messages that normally just say um, whether they're funny or whatnot. So I saw this lorry and the message was... Dealing with a married woman, it's like driving a government car, which cannot be yours. Hey, <laughs> hey, my goodness, Abego. What dealing with a uh, married woman is like driving a government's car which cannot be yours. I'm telling you, I just laughed when I saw this message and I was like, all right, whoever has thought about this, what do you think? Is it a yes? Is it a no? Please type in the comments and let's hear your views.